21 car of Al Munster Jr. Looks like something may have broken loose on the car in the setup for turn number two. While most of us don't drive 150 miles per hour around a track, sometimes our highways can seem just as dangerous. Dean Sicking and his staff and students at the Midwest Roadside Safety Facility are working to make driving safer. Each year, Sicking's innovations have helped to save hundreds of lives and prevent countless injuries. My primary area of research is roadside safety, and I've been working on developing safer roadside features for the last 27 years. We developed guardrail terminals, bridge rails, crash cushions, breakaway devices, and geometric features. Over 30 motorsports facilities have installed Sicking's Safer Barrier, an energy-absorbing barrier that gives drivers a better chance of surviving a high-speed crash and protects other drivers, crew, and fans from flying debris. The way it functions is it uses a rigid steel barrier backed up by energy-absorbing blocks. The barrier remains basically parallel to the track, so it doesn't allow the barrier to wrap around the front of the car, we call that pocketing, and slow the car down longitudinally. And the subsequent remainder of the crash is the process of the energy absorbing blocks sucking energy out of the car and out of the barrier itself. And the primary function of this barrier is to give the car time to redirect. Sicking safety technologies can be seen along virtually every mile of highway in America. The big difference between racetrack safety and highway safety is cost. But if you can bring the cost down to the point that even your local counties and cities can afford to use it, the benefits from those safety features can be extended to everybody in the country. And, and that's really been the focus of our work.